Well, hello everyone. Welcome to Fiddle Tune Friday once again. Well, we have a couple of tunes on today's program, but just before we do those two, I'd like to say a big hello to Ruth Thompson out there from Nova Scotia. Uh, thank you, Ruth, for your comments and your phone call recently. Nice to hear from you. And we had a nice, uh, com some nice comments from Greg Whitehead uh, down in Tennessee. And so, Greg, this is a big Canadian hello to you down there. And also say hello to your dad as well. I want to send uh, these two tunes out to Helen and Doug and Edgar. We've mentioned their names a time or two up on the Tobit. Uh, these folks have been great in the music business up there. She plays the fiddle and the piano and also has been responsible for, sorry, for some fiddle camps up there as, as well. And uh, Garb, we're going to send this out to all the folks along the Tobit River. Uh, we uh, uh, were part of uh, the fiddles on the Tobit up there. That's where canoes got in the the river and uh, came down and there was all kinds of music, fiddling and piano playing and all kinds of things like that. And the, fifth, the 25th anniversary was in 2019, so hello to all you folks up there. We have two versions of the Mouth of Tobik. We have the, one of the original that we're going to play that goes back a number of decades and was composed up in the Tobik area. And then, uh, of course, Don Messer had a version of the Mouth of Tobik too, which many of us play. So we're going to do both of them today and hope you enjoy. And I'll also mention this too. Stay tuned at the end of our, the twos and tunes we do at the end of our program. There's an important announcement there, okay? All right, are we ready, Bill? Can you jingle? <laughs> of the Toby. Hope you enjoyed those and maybe you were playing along with us. We have an important announcement coming right up. Till we see you again next Friday, have a good week folks. Stay tuned. Oh, hi folks. <laughs> Vivian and Ivan here and I'm glad to have you come into our home. And as you can see, we're sitting here in our front room and uh well, i guess we're just about ready for christmas eh, Viv? a few decorations around now. how are you folks <laughs> making out out there yeah. i bet they're all set up too i think so yes well we i've been sitting here just going over a few tunes and and then every once in a while vivian will drop in and we'll start talking about uh oh our music and kind of what 2020 has been like and uh, of course uh, it's not been the very best at least for 
the musicians and uh, well you know we we are, we look back over the years and think of all the nice things that we've been able to do with our music uh, go out to nursing homes uh, uh, benefits and play our music you know in front of people live in front of people or doing a nice a concert out uh, uh, it's just uh, you know without a f with just a few exceptions uh, that has not been able to happen this year it's been kind of lonely Ivan uh, it gets a little bit lonely you know we stay very close to home as we're asked to do we haven't we don't see all of the fans who come to the concerts and the, the dear old folks in the nursing homes who, when you start to play, they, they tap their toes or their fingers or sing along. That's, that's really what it's all about, isn't it? It really is. I, I, I like to see a live audience in front of me. But anyway, we haven't been able to do that. However, we have been able to do Fiddle Tune Friday. Fiddle Tune Friday's ah, on the docket, yep. Yes, <laughs> uh, and that uh, means a lot to us. You folks out there who look in, and maybe more people will look in, as now uh, also we do really appreciate what you say and uh, your appreciation for that Fiddle Tune Friday. And we did, uh, in the spring we did a video, so we were busy playing our music there, of course, and I think some of you people have that video out there. and. Um, uh, we have a community fiddling group. Actually, 2020, they're in their to 42nd. their 42nd year. Yes. 42nd year, whoa. Anyway, uh, it's a group of people. We haven't been able to meet with them since the, the COVID-19 came in. And uh, only one month, and that was October, and then we had to stop again. So we really miss seeing these folks and having a few tunes with them. Sussex Avenue fiddlers. Yes. <laughs> And you know, Phil, yes. at this time of the year, November, December, we welcome and have welcomed a lot yes. of buses into our home. And they come in with the folks on board, usually full buses, and they come in for a dinner, yeah. a turkey dinner. Oh, boy, I'm miss, missing that too. <laughs> You're missing the dinner. <laughs> and then they tour our home and property, and uh, then we give them a, a kitchen party, and uh, so they usually here about three hours, so we're missing all of that uh, this year, and uh, so, uh, you know, we, we've been discussing, oh my gosh, how can we get to you folks out there besides the Fiddle Tune Friday and so on, and I think we've got, I think we're, we're, we're getting there, we've got something special that's uh, do, I, going to happen. It's coming. Very <laughs> soon. So we want you folks out there, we're not going to tell you about any of it, but we want you to stay tuned and for more information. See you later. <laughs>